I'm Adam Lambert, and you're watching 4music.com. It's surreal. I mean, I think that's the way to describe it. It just, it always, you know, just even flying here, you know, a couple days ago, knowing that this was my next thing on the, on the horizon, I was just like, this is crazy. It's, ma it's, it's, it's like, it's major, and, and, and I feel so honored, and I feel so humbled by it. I mean, I don't know, because I think I'm going to bring my own shoes. So, uh, and hopefully Freddie would approve. I think they'll be pretty fabulous. Um, <laughs> I just want to get paid more to do what I love. <laughs> That's, that was like my audition. That's why I went to American Idol. I said, I want to be able to do this on a broader scale and get more opportunities. And, and look what it led to. I mean, I would have never dreamed that it, I would have gotten to the end of the show. Never. You know, and, and I never thought that I would get signed even. I was, I'm a little older, you know, when, when I was an idol, I, I, I was 27 when I auditioned, and I've been, I went through a lot in my 20s. Like, I saw a lot of things, and I traveled a lot, and I did a lot of different projects, and um, did a lot of theater productions, traveled to Europe, you know. I, I, I think all of my experiences really helped me prepare for idol. I really feel lucky. I feel lucky that I have this, this, this opportunity to kind of set, um, set a tone that suggests that you can be whoever you want to be, you know? And that even if you are someone that's different, um, you, can, you can have a dream that seems kind of wild and you can get to it, you know? And that's the best part. It's the best thing to be able to, to inspire people with, is to say, you know what, it doesn't matter who you are, you know? Determination and, and positivity will get you to where you need to go. There was, I think there was a period, I think my seventh grade, when I was like an adolescent, that, that year was, was really hard. Because I remember I would go to school and I had no friends at school. I was very much on my own. I had a couple friends in classes, but like I remember doing like, I always like dreaded lunch. I'm like, who am I gonna sit with? I, I was definitely like, a, I was like kind of an outsider at that point and, and that felt a little crazy. But you know, I, I think that made me a stronger person and it, and it caused me to, um, be independent and depend on, you know, myself and I think that that does make you strong, you know. There's no on and off switch uh, when you're when it comes to people knowing who you are. And sometimes it feels amazing. And especially, you know, when, when people are really appreciating you for what you do, you know what I mean? And when you're on stage and you're performing or you're at an event and you're there um, you know, taking pictures on the red carpet or doing an interview or something. It's, it feels great and it's really exciting. But then there are moments where you want to like, just like live like a normal life or go to the grocery store or do things that like normal people do. And you can hear people going, is that, is that Adam Lambert? It's so, it's so weird, you know? Um, I mean, I'm not complaining, but it gets awkward, you know? Yeah, there's some fans that get excited and I get hugs and then the, 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 the nose and the mouth kind of get right in there. It's a little weird, you know? Boundaries, physical boundaries. Oh, you can't, I don't know the meaning of life yet. Um, I mean, I, I kind of think that life is all about constantly trying to find out what's up, you know, with yourself, with other people. Um, but it's always a process and everybody's always evolving. And I think that, I think life is just about forward motion. I think that's really important. Um, but I wouldn't be able to tell you what the meaning of life is yet. I'm not that wise. I got years to go before I could tell you what I thought that was. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Aw, so sweet. She's pretty. Too fattening. Most of the time. Tasty. <laughs> I'm trying to think what to say. Absolute rubbish. <laughs> That's what he said to me one time when I was singing. I love Simon though. He's great. He was very supportive. But he said to me one time, I thought it was absolute rubbish. Self-indulgent rubbish. Simon.